Welcome to another video. I'm outside in my garden and I wanted to show this 55 gallon rain barrel. It's in green. It does come with a brass spout that you insert there. I have it up on a center block. It's level and it's in an area of the yard where there's nothing above it. Um, so that the water that comes down is not blocked by anything and it can just get a straight aim. It comes with this hose that's for the overflow and you can also um, drain it into like one of these things that you attach to your gutter or another barrel or um, something that you can downflow it into. And then this is to attach the hose. It does come with this metal screen to keep the bugs and the mosquitoes out. Here's the brass sprout. You attach it on the inside with this rubber gasket and the nut. And then these screws right here are to attach the lid to keep anything from getting into it and it's on all four sides. Then this is where you attach the rubber hose and it does have a space where you can attach the rubber hose to both. So it does come with Spanish and English instructions. And this is the brand. That's what's included, that's what you need. Pretty simple and self-explanatory. That's how the setup is. And again, like I said, mine is level on a center block and there's like nothing above it. Um, just a straight shot to the sky. So I'm going to put this together and I'm gonna to try to film it, but I'm out here by myself. So I'll do the best that I can. you're gonna put the hose on here and then you're gonna pull this fastener down over the hose and tighten it with a Phillips screwdriver so here is the hose on with the fastener and I just have mine running off into this old cement mixer until I can get either another container or maybe a bucket that I can just put like a mesh screen or something on top of but I use this as a rainwater catcher and I just use that to um, water my flowers and garden and stuff every day. The next thing I'm going to do is put the brass spout on. Like I said, this part, the nut and the rubber gasket goes on the inside of this little hole right here. So of course I cannot film and do this at the same time. Like I said, I'm out here by myself and then I'll put the, the screws in all four corners of the um the lid there's one here and then there's one in the back okay so here is the brass spout really easy to put on that's how it looks i wanted it lifted up off the ground so if i had to attach a hose or something to it or just to drain, like put a bucket or something under it. I wouldn't have to worry about it later, about lifting it up off the ground, so. And the inside, like I said, is just the nut and the rubber gasket. So the screws were pretty simple to put on. I'm just using my little Black & Decker handheld. I love how it turned out. I hope to get something else to catch the water in, but for now, that will do. Thank you all so much for watching. If you have any questions, leave them down below, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Have a great day. Bye.